Dragon, SpaceX on the big loop, all hooks open. And Dragon separation confirmed. All 12 hooks now open. Hooks all open and release confirmed at 11.05 a.m. Central Time while Dragon and the International Space Station flew 259 statute miles above the North Atlantic Ocean. We're sad to see you go. We wish you Godspeed. Uh, safe re-entry and landing and uh, calm seas. We're going to miss you guys. We're thankful for your mentor mentorship. Enjoy your time with your families. The, uh, good work, Station. It was an uh, absolute pleasure and privilege to, to serve on the Space Station these past six months. And a joy to get to work with you all uh, for the past couple of weeks. We know that you're going to uh, continue to do amazing things on station. We look forward to seeing you uh, back home as well. Once the expected blackout period is over, the core here in Mission Control will attempt to establish communications with the crew. So you may hear some call outs checking in with the crew. Uh, and they will make that call out until the crew does respond, which will confirm acquisition of signal. We have about two minutes remaining in the anticipated period of uh, communications blackout. Now, it's not an exact science. There might be some variation that occurs. Uh, we might hear from the crew a little earlier the, than we expected or potentially a little bit later. Um, but we are all on the edge of our seats, eagerly awaiting um, to hear from the crew. So far, everything looking good. Those drug shoots, and you can hear the crowd here very excited to see them deploy. Drug shoot descent rate nominal and visual on two healthy drugs. Freedom copies. Very cool view of Dragon with the two drogue shoots. We are just anticipating the main shoots to deploy here shortly. Nominal, visual on four healthy mains. And great news, as you can see there, the main shoots have deployed, slowing the Dragon vehicle down significantly down to approximately 119 miles per hour. Freedom is 1,000 meters. Copy 1,000. Now Dragon has saved all propulsion systems and is now terminating the nitrox suit and cabin purges and is beginning to increase. Freedom is 800 meters. Copy, 800. So we did get that confirmation on the main shoots. 600. The 
crew is now 600 meters away from splashing down. We do expect splash down in about two minutes from now. Landing in water is simpler, therefore more reliable, and it provides more margin against unlikely parachutes. Three to 400 meters. Copy, four. Provides more margin against unlikely parachute issues. We had to learn how to make Dragon waterproof. But once you do, it is a rinse, review, and reuse type of process. And we are just about a minute away from splashdown of the Dragon vehicle back onto planet Earth. And hearing good callouts of the altitude of Dragon. Brings at 200 meters, we're bracing for splashdown. Copy, brace for splashdown. And again, that descent rate is as expected here. Pretty soon, we should be able to see the view of the ocean come into view as Crew Dragon Freedom, with four astronauts on board, prepares to splash down after spending 170 days in space after launching on April 27th. Those wild four through four. Copy freedom, space up to spot down and mains cut. Welcome Copy. home. Cut. Welcome home, crew four. Great view watching dragons splash down back on planet Earth. Now, as you can see on your screen, we have visual confirmation for a splashdown of the Dragon spacecraft. Dragon Freedom has returned home, and NASA astronauts Chell, Bob, Jessica, and ES. SpaceX, Freedom, we are water uprighting and stable one. 